This is my first time I am seeing that a boy is excited for going to shopping. So always yeah. this on YouTube. Yeah. Even boys hate shopping. Check like Vail with his Buddha always farting in. Hello friends, Satchiri Akal. Welcome back to our channel Yanki Royal Reactionary. I am Amanpreet Kaur. She is Neha. And today we are up with another video. In this video, we are going to react on Paul Bart German's first time and reaction differences to Europe. So let's see what's there in today's video. We know that Walmart is kind of a supermarket where you can get all the food, appliances, clothing, etc. etc. Just like I think Sainsbury's in uh, UK. So let's see what's there in today's video and then we will talk about it. Yes, even in India, we have V Mart and D Mart. So I am really very, you know, curious to know that the Walmart is the same, have same stuff as we have in India. So let's check it out with this video and find out what is exciting in this video. So without wasting any time, let's get into this video. What's up, everybody? We are Deanna and Phil. Deanna here is from the United States and I, Phil, am from Germany. Ooh. And this is still my first time wow. in the US and it's finally time. We are going to a Walmart. Walmart. I have no idea why you're so excited about this. Well, let's find out. Oh my God. This is my first time I am seeing that a boy is excited for going to shopping. So always yeah. this on YouTube. Even boys hate shopping. Jack Vale with his Buddha always farting in Walmart or whatever. Or all these pranks that went down in Walmart. So it became kind of a, a running joke, a running gag for us that I'm super excited to go to Walmart. It looks such, <laughs> like such a magical place. They wow. have everything. It was kind of ironic, so but I've said it so it. often that I'm kind of uh, actually excited for it. I heard but from some of our friends that Walmart right has everything Here it is. and it's quite cheap, the Walmart. I think. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Whoa. Wow. Right as we enter, first thing, still Halloween, it's October. Okay. Even a Walmart, big Halloween selection. All decoration I think this on is the kid stuff, but I wouldn't mind Halloween. Sort. It's Halloween. Yep. Phil, I think you should wear one of these wigs. What do you think? Those are wigs? Is that for Halloween or is it regular stuff? These are all creepy. Why are they so scary? Oh, we can be. Oh my goodness, you want to be a mouse with me? Look, it even has dough on it. Oh my goodness, I'm a mouse. Duh. Oh, <laughs> hey, it's so oh. nice. Twenty-three dollars. Four hundred nice. miniature ones. Nice. This is a big pack. First thing I'm noticing here, it's a huge supermarket, and uh, I already see the big packs. How much is this? Three point three kilograms. That's what I can do in a weekend. Seven pounds or something. All right, this is the craziest section to me. I first saw these, and those are all BB guns. And look how cheap they are. $50, $40, yeah, $35 for like a That's rifle looking BB gun or whatever. But Welcome to America. Okay, it's a BB gun. <laughs> this is Welcome to America. We are in a Walmart still and there are actual guns here. $250, $600. Whoa, like those are actual shotguns, weapon? I think. Yes, yes. <gasps> You can get them all the camouflage colors. I feel like if you get a gun and you get in a camouflage color, that's shocking. Even more than like the normal, like no, you're probably a hunter. Yeah, well, you don't. I don't know. Whatever. I think those are like actual rifles. Crazy. Get all the accessories here. These are all for hunting. Scopes. Get binoculars. Corner for hunters. And then in the background, you have all the crazy guns. Look at the huge shotgun. Why this is that one point seven? Is that not real? I never I kind saw of anything like this. Bit, and you can get decent Same. guns for like two to yeah. four hundred dollars. Nine millimeter pistol, like a Glock or something. That's just three hundred fifty, four hundred dollars. It's crazy. That's like cheap stuff. Everybody can afford that in the U.S., right? Yeah. That's, that's like a week of groceries. You can get yeah. a full-on exactly. <laughs> deadly weapon for that. I feel scared. Let's go in different places. This is really very really strange. Right. So they have a bar soap section. Okay. As I told you, all the bar soaps, but. Girls' favorite section, Six. I think. Finally, Same I found the body washing. I can see all the brands. This is what you're yes. looking for. Yeah, but look at the sizes. How much is this? 700 milliliters for 547. Weird, crooked number. We so could've... they have the body wash. They have the shower gel. Yeah, we couldn't uh, find amazing. it at the other supermarkets. Yes. But before. the Americans go for this one. <laughs> That's not true. Get your, how many are those? 10 bar soaps? I don't know. It's just uh, very expensive to me. Suave Men. Is that like a Walmart brand? I think it's a cheaper or Walmart brand. So I can finally shower. Okay. He hasn't showered so the whole time. So they have their it's own disgusting. brand also. 
Denture cleanser. What is that? <laughs> I need it for my retainer. <laughs> Kills millions of bacteria. Fight soda. Removes stains. For your container? I need it for my retainer. Oh, all right. There's a garden section and wow. they have pre-made Christmas trees with all the lights on. There's so much Christmas stuff. The so cute! Yeah, they start putting the Christmas stuff out so early. Some people get so mad. Why do they get mad? I don't know, they just get annoyed. They'll start playing Christmas music in October. Are you getting mad? No, I like yes. it. What comes next? Ooh, Fourth of so July? Cute. Eastern? <laughs> New Year. Do you, do you celebrate house. Eastern here? Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's not Christmas. Who are you? Okay, question. Diana likes the Christmas stuff. I'm <gasps> neutral. Snowman. Do you get annoyed with the Christmas stuff being out this early? And uh, no, I feel like it's we, a we like forcing it. you to buy things, but let us know if you get annoyed with that. Pokemon. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, yes. That's Pikachu. Pikachu. Yeah. It feels like we're suddenly in another store. It's a full on clothing store. We've got Clemson. colleges, Clemson. Clemson. And USC, University of South Carolina, what back there. The hey, wow! Yes, the garden. That's no, only that's for nine dollars. I always wonder what all the Dutch Whoa. stuff is doing here. Dutch? Wow. Yeah, nobody likes the Dutch. Well, wow, actually, everybody likes the Dutch, but <laughs> <Not bad. laughs> so orange. Like, look at that stuff. Are the Dutch known for orange? Yeah, very similar to yeah, Primark. Yeah, they're the orange. Oh, I don't know. Yes. Holland. I'm from Rotterdam. Don't wear that. It's insulting. It looks horrible, to be honest. The orange <laughs> stuff. Are you a Clemson or a USC fan? Game! Cox! Or neither. Wow, cool kid. Hey, hey Phil. I've got your back. Some camouflage stuff nice. around here. You don't have nice to be redneck to have camouflage. Well, I go, come with my truck. I'm coming in with my truck and I'm uh, unloading my gun. Makes no sense. <laughs> so I'm gonna go and buy me some camouflage Make stuff no and maybe new truck ahead. You sound mm. Australian. Nah, new truck ahead. It's fair dinkum nice. <laughs> Let's see if we can turn myself into an American. I like this print. Whoa. Wow. He honestly really wants a lumberjack outfit, but I Super told him cool. I don't know why. Let me know if it looks good. It doesn't. Oh Which my color goodness, do you no, like? Please no. I like the red one. I'm not into it. I, even I like no? the red one. <laughs> I feel important. I feel less attracted to you. I think all the girls would fall in love with me. Right at the second. Like, why is I don't think anyone's gonna like this? in love with you. Huh, this is not oh, a good combination. This is so cringe. This is so frightening. Okay. I'm carrying a concealed okay, weapon. So I need to protect my family and my property. Giving a match to That's why I wear these outfits. Yes. Please step back, sir. This could be interpreted as an assault to you. Why does your voice get more nasal? You sound nerdy. That's how the people talk. No one talks like that. Yeah, it's <gasps> somebody who has a higher pitched voice but tries to be intimidating. I feel so unattracted to you right now. My boner's gone. So proud. Wow, such cool stuff. Toys for babies. Wow, such a huge collection. Dude, this is so awesome. They have a whole anime section here. I love that. Samurai Champloo, one of my favorites. They have all boys and Ghost in the Shell, yes. My Hero Academia. Yes, exactly. They have Spirited Away. All the Dragon Ball stuff. Oh, that's more. We Howl's do. Moving Castle, Kiki's Delivery Service. This is what I'm missing. I always imagined that Japan has all this stuff and I want that. Well, I want that in my life. Yeah. <laughs> Finally getting close to the food section. We made it to the food. Are they getting anything or they are just having an empty basket? <laughs> yeah. This wow. entire section is just Oreos. Dude, they have carrot cake. I've never now seen Now I before. know why this boy is exciting to go to Walmart. Oreos, now, He's uh, just uh, going to our window shopping. Versions, and we should eat them all and see which <laughs> yes. one is the best. Uh, but also, look at it. This is like four dollars sixty plus things, and it's. Is it a mi Oh, it's, it's a huge Oreo. Portion. It's a family. Yeah, time. we oh, all love them. Family. Family. <laughs> family is so it's pretty so big. Oh, yes. Fudge covered. That sounds amazing. That sounds really good. Everything with fudge. Where's the small portions? They don't have any small okay. ones. 432 gram. It's the smallest version. So if we want to try them all, we have to buy 20 for an average of four dollars. It's gonna be 80 dollars of Oreos. The prices are so weird. They're all so crooked. Like we have usually 249, 299, uh, something like yeah. that. 356, 274. Okay. I have to add the tax afterwards. Yeah. And it's so dumb. It's like, I don't know. I'm not paying 274 for this one. Okay. 
and I'm not paying 256 for that one. 1474, what kind of price is that? And you're adding, I don't know, 7% tax or something like that? Mm -hmm. It's gonna be 15. Yes, taxes in the US are much. And you have that no idea. Mean. But again, look at this. 240 pieces. It's for Halloween. Yeah. Like look at, you can even get a baby in here. Oh, it's like this baby. <laughs> Dude, I was totally looking for energy drinks the other day and I went with the uh, standard Monster Energy. Monster. But I see this rain yes. brand displayed in every supermarket and I was like, it's probably the same stuff. And I had a look at it and check this thing out. It says 300 milligrams of caffeine in this can and the can is a little under 500 milliliters. It's like 70 milligrams per 100 milliliters. And in Europe, the legal limit is 32. Every Red Bull, every Monster Energy has 32 milligrams. Okay. About I never noticed so that. Twice as crazy. Next time, I don't know anything about <laughs> Check energy this. drinks. It's crazy. Dude, that blew my mind. If you're drinking a whole can of this, you're like running through a wall. <laughs> <laughs> running through all the world. <laughs> this is fun. This, this is childhood honey buns. Have you had this before? No. Oh. And Swiss rolls. Swiss rolls. Swiss roll. We all uh, love yeah, this. Yeah, we have something similar. Swiss we should just yes. try them all. Oh my goodness. All right, here's a good example of prices and sizes. This is everyday low price, right? But here in the UK, it's all the bakery stuff have cheese eggs, slices. so we can't and take it. It's four dollars, yeah. so to me it's like, oh my god, it's pretty expensive, but also, but it's 450 grams, it's a hundred pounds. I think it's almost 200 in grams, yes, so it's like two, easily, yeah. normal size yeah. in Germany. The red cups, the famous beer pong cups, right? Yes, well, there's, we have yeah. yeah. But this is the Walmart brand of solo cups. cups. The, oh, there's an official brand, which are the right yes. ones? Yeah, solo cups. We don't have them. You have to order them on Amazon, super overpriced. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah, in India we have white. Ones, we have white That's so cup. funny. This is like it's college. Paper cup. Yeah. yeah. Just beans, three yeah. kilograms, one can. All the beans. Three thirty-four. That's actually not that expensive. With a nice little glass of pickles oh. on the side. I love pickles. <laughs> pickles. Uh, no, 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 no. That's too big. Ten pounds, five kilogram of boneless chicken. This is what I live off. It's ten dollars. Dollar per pound, it's so cheap. Chicken is something that's very cheap in the US, it's crazy. Okay. okay. So one thing I'm noticing, this is the chocolate, chocolate section. section. And the actual chocolate, that is pure chocolate, is very little in the US. Yeah. They have a couple of Lindt brands here. And there's some yeah, Hershey's so here. Dove chocolate. Um, but it's all with nuts or something. Okay. And we have a lot of the pure chocolate, the yeah. Milka brand, Ritter Sport, and everybody goes for the milk chocolate, the standard the version. Side but I think you have way, way more okay. cookies and chips and like candy bars, but yeah. the pure chocolate is very limited, Okay. Right? Well, yeah, they have a great value, Hershey's, and then we have like all these imported with the Lynn, but yeah, it's usually filled with something. That's what I'm saying. It's the, the, the normal chocolate is hard to find. Like, yeah. which one should I pick for a normal milk chocolate that I want? I like Lindt. Well, Lindt is, it's $3 for- That's good stuff. It's $3 for 100 grams and it's Swiss. So where's I the like American Skype one? Food. That's the American one. It's 200 grams for $2. Cheese. So that's also the cheapest one yes. here. Let's try. I mean, I like Cadbury's fruit and nut. Yeah. That's awesome. This is the embodiment <gasps> cheese of America. Cheese balls. Bolitas de queso. I love cheese balls. Baked cheddar. Six dollars. Only 150 calories per yeah. serving. There's one thing that annoys me. It always states per serving. And then I have to look at how much is a serving. The serving is 28 grams. It's kind of like four times. So 600 calories per 100 grams. So now I know it's very bad. But if people just look at it, oh, serving 150, that's nice. It's 800 grams. Those are 5,000 calories in a thing. Worth it. Dude, frozen, frozen food section. <gasps> oh my God, I just spotted these. Look, Look at, that. at that. The White Castle sliders. Yes. Why, are they, why are they 20 bucks? Uh, I know it's White Castle. You have a whole movie, Harold and Kuma. Go to White Castle. It's, so it must be amazing. Anyway, dude, look at the frozen section. I think it's very nice. You have very nice closets here. <laughs> They're not closets. This one is <laughs> quite large. To the pizza I sizes. So because not I like frozen pizza. Like, as I guess. like these are kind of yeah. the smallest ones. 500 gram. Oh, and it's, it's like $5.50, $5. yes. $5. yeah. which is yeah. kind of expensive. Yes. 
They have yeah, everything. That's almost like pizza. pizza. Yeah, for everything 750 needs, grams. So that's like usually two pizzas of the normal stuff, ones. Dr. Oetker, whatever we have. Wow, okay. Like $8 for a frozen pizza. Nice. $9.73 for a frozen pizza. $6.34. Frozen section is crazy. There are like three of these aisles. So six of these super long hallways of frozen food. I like it. Dude, I'm so excited that I found these. Deanna and Phil go into White Castle. Yes. Bakery. Ah, oh, I just met a fan. The fans are all here. How are you doing? <laughs> this might be our biggest fan, but this fan might be just equally as big. Oh, you just Very nice just to meet for $17. A lot of fans around here. Yes. I like that. Not bad. I like the self checkout. You don't have to interact with people. It was good. It was not as crazy as I thought. We got some stuff. Yeah. We got some nice cheese balls. Got there. the cheese balls. I wanted them after you pointed them out. It's a big pack. We're gonna try them. Ah, yeah. It's an interesting supermarket. You have so many sections. Like, there's an abundance of food of availability there. I really enjoyed it. I like the the Walmart experience. And I feel like you could live just going to Walmart. You can yeah. decorate your home. You get your car needs. There's a pharmacy in there. Okay, the so the pharmacy is also there. Clothing yeah. section. That's There's yeah, really no need cool. to go somewhere else than Walmart. Our supermarkets usually don't have the clothing section or the pharmacy section. It's yes. Nice. Yeah, I like this. Walmart, damn. You didn't disappoint me. <laughs> <laughs> this trip was definitely worth it. I haven't had these in like over 10 years. Mm. They're so dry. I love it. Anyway, that was my first Walmart experience. I am not disappointed. It's not super special, but it's fun. You can get everything. And I'm super excited to try these. White if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, tell us what you think about Walmart. Have you ever been to a Walmart? Is it your favorite thing ever? Also, is a Target better? Is a Target even better? If you may be watching from Germany, let us know uh, what you think about the differences to European supermarkets or any other European country you might be from. The prices are pretty high still, even though it's a cheap supermarket, right? And the weird pricing, like the 374 plus the taxes, <laughs> that drives me just nuts. As always, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye! So here we have come to the end of the video and yes, this video was very interesting because it was all about shopping and groceries. So I love these kind of videos yeah. and uh, and the, that Walmart was giving me a feeling of Asda because uh, I think ju just a week ago we went to Asda for the first time. It's been four or five years in UK but we haven't went to Asda but yes, a week ago we went to Asda and it was just same. The clothing section is a huge grocery, frozen food, everything you can get in Asda. I know everything is available in Sainsbury as well, but Sainsbury is not that big just like Asta. Asta was a huge, I like that supermarket. And, uh, but I find the prices quite same like UK. I cannot say that US is, uh, US is more, US has more prices or something like that. But yes, I think the prices are same or maybe one or two dollars or pounds just uh, difference. But yes, the video was quite interesting and these two guys made it more interesting how they were talking about everything yeah. so i like it yes you know even in india we have v mart and d mart but uh these two uh shopping malls were not like uh, you know so much of huge quantity products so walmart is very similar to india's metro uh actually shopping uh mall so uh, the the products and the look wise the interior is very similar to metro shopping mall so I, I just feel very, you know, relatable when they were talking that they were uh, giving these uh, rates and, uh, you know, you got um, uh, taxes uh, on the original bill. So yes, even in India, we have that same problem because sometimes you were uh, fix things uh, on the other prices and when you bill it out, you get some GST and VAT and other so much of taxes. So yes, there is uh, some malls there you can find this taxes problem as well. But the way they were talking with each other, the funny way and the very surprising thing is that 
uh, in India shopping mall, you never find the pharmacy products and never uh, find the, you know, guns and uh, some kind of hunting products. So this is really very surprising for me. And I like this uh, that uh, in a single Walmart, you can find anything you want in your life. And the commentary and the whole conversation between two, uh, these two guys are very, very interesting and I enjoy this video. Okay guys, let's end it here. If you like it, then please hit the like button. If you are new to the channel, then go and subscribe now. Do let us know your thoughts in the comment section and we'll see you in the next video. Till then, okay, bye.